We are here at the People Playground Airport. And the reason I'm here is to conduct some experiments on some different ragdolls. So over here, we have some standard ones. We even have a D-Class personnel and uh, SCP-096. A little bit strange. Don't worry, these guys are guarding. Oh, whoops. Oh, we shouldn't do that with explosives. There's uh, quite a lot of them, but just ignore the explosives. That's not why we're here today. And we also have some FNAF animatronics. So essentially, I'm going to fly and drop them out of the sky. Slight issue though, I don't know how to fly um oh no what happened oh not the airport oh whoops okay we're gonna need a new plane don't worry i'll rally up the troops and they'll gather all the ragdolls back right here we go again um okay how do i pull up pull up come on it's it's not really working um oh no not the airport again oh no let's try for a third time right i've gone for a different runway so now the airport shouldn't be an issue for us I just need to figure out how we actually pull up. Yeah, haven't really flown this plane before. Oh, here we go. Is it working? Oh, I dropped the bombs. That's fine. We need to get rid of them anyway. Oh, landing is. Uh-oh. Um, Bonnie, <laughs> hang in there. Okay, so I think... Oh, is the plane actually going up now? Finally, yes, we have liftoff. Oh, no, Bonnie. What is going on? It's fine. We've lost an animatronic. We can get Bonnie back for another test run. Don't worry. We just need to actually take off. But I think the plane might actually be broken. We should probably get the landing gear back. Oh, no, the plane. It's breaking apart right now. Oh, no. <laughs> hey, look at the ragdolls in the back. You know what? We can release them, right? Go. Get ejected. Come on. Get out. Be free. Oh, wait. What the? Oh, there we go. There's one gone. Oh, we still need to release the other ones. How do I? Come on. Oh, no. What the? We've hit the other side of the map. Oh, another plane down. Oh, the ragdolls are getting messed up right now. I think it's fair to say we're going to need another plane. So I actually think it's the weight of the plane, which is the issue. We had too many ragdolls inside. So hopefully now we should be able to pull up. Yes. Oh, here we go. We are gaining some air, right? Put the gears in. Oh, it's working beautifully now. Okay. So as for the bombs, we don't need them. So let's just go ahead and release them. Did they actually blow up on impact? Yes, they do. That's pretty epic. Wait, did that just do some damage to us? I think it might have done a little bit. Anyway, we're now getting some altitude. Uh, we're locked in to Bonnie right here. And we're going to go ahead and eject right now. Here we go. Oh, yes. We have just pushed Bonnie out of a plane. We're so high up. Okay, let's see what happens here. Oh, <laughs> okay. Not too much. Oh, no. Bonnie survived. They've escaped. <laughs> oh, no. Quick, go in for landing. Operation Retrieve Bonnie. Pull up. Oh, no. Whoops. Okay, looks like we need another plane once again. Who would have thought it? But before we get another plane, I need to deal with Bonnie. So I've gone ahead and captured him. And he's in this test chamber right now with the jet engine. So uh, let's see what happens. Maybe we're going to melt his face off. All right, let's go ahead and start, shall we? That's it. Just reach up. Okay, there we go. Oh, it's working. Oh, uh -huh, wait, the door. We gotta close it. Close the door. That's it. There we go. Oh, look how red he's going. Oh, he's on fire. Yes, that is epic. <laughs> that is so cool. That is one way to kill an animatronic from Five Nights at Freddy's. Burn. Okay, shut down the system real quick. Uh, let's see. Cooling system. Fire system? Sure. There we go. Just cool it down. Wait, I think Bonnie might actually be dead. Like, fully dead. It actually worked. All right, you know what? Let's turn it back on and open the exhaust door. Hopefully, we can go ahead and eject the animatronic out of here. No? Okay, looks like we might have to do this manually. All right, uh, it's sending the scientists. Okay, stop it. And uh, fire system, cooling system. Okay, let's get in there. That's it, excuse me. Out of my way. Right, what seems to be the issue here? What is going on? Wait, oh no. Who turned it back on? There's a scientist in here. Oh no. Oh, he's getting messed up. Okay. Well, that experiment went very well to begin with and now has ended in disaster. What a real shame. Now, I know these guys right here are not fans of water. Um, plane? What happened? Well, I guess we need another one now. Anyway, as I was saying, these guys right here do not like water. So I'm going to go ahead and, well, fly over water. Pull up. Drop the bombs. We don't need them. Oh, whoops. Oh, too low. That's fine. We, we don't need that piece of the plane anyway. All right. Now drop the animatronics. 
Here we go. Oh, Foxy's going. Oh, yep. There we go. Let's watch him hit the water. Oh, only just he hit the side. And now he's being electrocuted. Look at that. Oh, sorry, Foxy. I'm so sorry. What about the others? Where are they? Oh, 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 no. Uh, Chica, you good? Uh, well, <laughs> not anymore. Oh, and there's Freddy just chilling there. Pretty injured by loads of things. And then Foxy is just completely fried. <laughs> oh, man. What a great way to kill an animatronic. Speaking of great ways to kill people and things, I've actually downloaded a combat mod which came with a bunch of different weapons and also useful items such as a jetpack. Whoa, 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 whoa. Easy. Okay, back down your cup. Come on. Oh, ooh. Okay, anyway, that's a jetpack. Now I'm going to show off the harpoon gun with this guy right here. Fire! Yes! Oh, that's so cool! Uh oh Oh, good thing you're wearing a helmet. How many times do we get to use the harpoon gun? Is it just the once? Oh, wait, what the... Oh! Oh, no. This uh, this is going very badly wrong. Okay, let's let's heal this guy and show off his glove that he's holding, shall we? Syringe inbound! Yep, he's fine. In the knee. So, these guys right here are the test subjects. Now, I can't remember what glove this guy actually has, so let's just see what happens, shall we? Hit! Yeah! doesn't seem to be doing a crazy amount all right you know what send in another dude let's see okay he's got a black belt on which apparently makes him a cry master that's what the mod says anyway and again can't remember what this glove does <gasps> oh my goodness okay okay this might be the most overpowered glove there is that's insane now this guy's wearing a belt and i can't exactly remember what the belt does oh it's a life stealer belt so what you just get health from other people? I don't really know how it works. And also, because he's wearing the fire fire helmet, does that mean that any fire damage he takes, he doesn't take damage? Only one way to find out! Flamethrower! Oh, it actually works! Look at that! He's fireproof! No way! Just because of the helmet. Uh, and just to test that actually works. Yep, see how he goes on fire? And this guy does not. That's actually really, really cool. You know what? I want to try the harpoon gun again. Right, let's see if it works. So we uh, fire it over there. Does that work? Okay, we got it back. We can give it another shot. Uh, doing it against brick isn't the best idea. You know what? I wonder what happens if I do this. Well, that's what happens. <laughs> okay, anyway, I've also got this laser glove. Oh, that seems pretty good. Whoa, that's really powerful. Look at this. Sorry, my fellow ragdolls. It's all for science, I'm afraid. Uh-oh. The tower doesn't look like it's in a uh, very good state right now. I'll be honest. Whoa. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Sorry. Whoops. Oh. Oh, no. That's bad. Oh, that's very bad. Down goes the tower. Experiments have gone very, very wrong. Oh, no. That is not good. Not good at all. I mean, very cool weapon pack, though. Hey, look, we got a survivor. This guy's completely fine. What are you shooting at? Whoa. Okay, now I think he might be dead. Oh, this guy's also fine because, of course, he's got the uh, the helmet on. Can't say the same for this dude. Okay, let's try the harpoon gun on wood. So this should actually work. So essentially, all I need to do is climb up here using the harpoon and then jump over the spikes right here. And then mission accomplished. All right, here we go. Harpoon away. Oh. <gasps> It works! Yes, look at me go! Oh, that's so cool. Okay, just hold on. Oh, wait, what the? Um, the wood is breaking. Oh, no. No! Oh, it flipped me! Oh. Um, well, that didn't go according to plan at all. But hey, at least a harpoon gun worked. So that's a plus, I guess. For the next harpoon challenge, we have to jump over lava. And when that ultimately fails, we're going to try the jetpack out. Okay, here we go. Raise the harpoon and fire. Oh, there we go. Ooh. Okay, that was a bad one. Let's just bring it back. We can just try again, right? Oh, okay, we're in. All right, now go across. Woohoo! Yeah! Oh, no. Okay, now what do we do in this situation? No, no, no! Oh, we're in the lava. Okay, send in the jetpack. That's it. Away you go. Yes, it's working. Oh, the jetpack is way more overpowered. Yeah, we get a lot more control with that thing, that's for sure. All right, power down. Oh, no. Oh. <laughs> you okay, buddy? No. <laughs> uh oh. He's off again. Hey, look, Bonnie has returned. Hi, Bonnie. What are you doing? Oh, you're going into lava? Okay. Well, down you go. Terminator style. Wow, what a great way to end this video. Subscribe!